Valentine's Day is almost here. I can't wait for it, and I don't think you can either. If you enjoyed this video, please like the video and subscribe to my channel. The next book in our series is Alvin and the Chipmunks, A Chipmunk Valentine by Kirsten Mayer. Alvin and the Chipmunks, A Chipmunk Valentine Alvin, Simon, and Theodore walk into West Eastman High on a blustery February morning. A few students give the musical trio high fives. Alvin chats with his football buddies in the hall, and Simon waves to his chess friends. Theodore stops them and points at a poster on the wall. Um, guys, he asks, did you know it's Valentine's Day today? Alvin and Simon turn to look at the red and pink poster on the wall. No, says Alvin. So what? So what? So we have to get the girls something, like flowers or chocolate. And we should take them to the dance, Simon says. Yum! Chocolate, says Theodore. Maybe the girls will share their chocolate with us. Why do we have to do all that? Can't I just give Brittany a high five, said Alvin. Alvin, from what I've read, it's a girl thing. It's what you do when you like someone, explains Simon. What? yells Alvin. Who says I like anybody? Just then, the chipettes walk by. Brittany winks at Alvin. I'm really excited about the dance tonight, she says. Jeanette blushes as she waves shyly at Simon. And Eleanor giggles as she smiles at Theodore. The boys smile and wave back. When the girls are gone, Alvin gulps. Um, I think we need to get flowers. Chocolate, asks Theodore. Yes and yes, says Simon, and Valentine cards too. What do we do, cries Theodore. This is no time to panic, responds Alvin. The chipmunks rush to the girls' homeroom and peek in the door. They see Brittany, Jeanette, and Eleanor, and then they see dozens of flowers piled high on Brittany's desk. We need something special, says Simon at lunchtime. There, shouts Theodore. He points to the cheerleaders in the cafeteria selling chocolate hearts for 50 cents each. Simon pulls out 50 cents. I can buy one, he says. Theodore hands over some change reluctantly. Now I won't be able to get my after-school snack, he sighs. Cough it up, Alvin, says Simon. Valentine's Day is expensive, exclaims Alvin as he hands over the money. Simon buys the candy while Alvin and Theodore wait. But then, Theodore feels a tap on his shoulder. He turns around to see Eleanor. Want some chocolate, she asks. Now what will they do? Someone already gave the chipettes candy. After school, the boys sit outside waiting for the girls. This is our last chance, says Simon. We have to give them these Valentine's cards we made. The three chipettes appear, laughing and chattering. Ladies, shouts Alvin, we have something for you. Really, asks Jeanette. Come with us to get our things from our lockers first. She jumps with excitement as she opens her locker. Out spills a huge pile of Valentine cards. What is it? asks Brittany as she helps Jeanette pick up all the cards. The boys shrug. Um, well, we will give it to you at the dance, says Alvin. Oh, okay, says Brittany. See you tonight then. Alvin! yells Simon and Theodore. What? he asks. You just told them we would give them a present at the dance, accuses Simon. And we don't have anything, Theodore sniffles. Would I let my brothers down, asks Alvin. Yes, they shout. Come on. We are the chipmunks. What do we do best, Alvin asks them. Drive Dave nuts, says Theodore. Other than that, Alvin says, we can serenade the girls at the dance. That's actually a good idea, says Simon. I can't believe I didn't think of that. Let's go practice, shouts Theodore. That night at the dance, Alvin, Simon, and Theodore are nervous. It's their one chance to make Valentine's Day a success. Red paper hearts and cardboard cupids are hung up all around the gym. The boys walk right past the girls and head to the stage. Brittany, Jeanette, and Eleanor pout a little. 
They think the boys are ignoring them. But then there's an announcement from the principal. Now we have a special treat for everyone: the chipmunks. The crowd goes wild as Alvin, Simon, and Theodore run onto the stage. Hey guys, calls Alvin. We are new to this whole Valentine thing, but this is for Brittany, Jeanette, and Eleanor. The chipettes run up to the stage and clap wildly as Alvin, Simon, and Theodore start to rock the party. Hey, hey, hey! This special song is just to say, Happy Valentine's Day. After the song, the girls run up to say thank you. Brittany has an armful of flowers. Eleanor has an armful of chocolate hearts, and Jeanette has an armful of Valentine cards. We thought you forgot about us, says Brittany. Alvin groans. We knew you already had all these presents, he starts to explain, and we really wanted you to get something special, finishes Simon, because you are special, adds Theodore. Then he blushes bright red. The girls laugh, but all of these are for you, the girls cheer. Happy Valentine's Day! Luckily, Alvin, Simon, and Theodore are so creative and were able to sing the Chipettes that song. Thank you for joining me in another book in my Valentine's Day series. Please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the Treasure Box. I will see you at the next reading. Bye!